what is going on today guys today we are going to be heading over to our horde base and we're going to be finishing that up as much as possible today now i see we got a little mr zombie trying to come across to us so let's go let's go say hello oh he went underwater that's a shame I'm gonna try to get him in the head oh there we go. Just like that. Now let's wait for him to get up and we'll finish him off here. There we go. Just like that. Hello there, Mr. Zombie. Nope, no arrow back for me. That's a shame. But anyway, we got a bit of stuff to do over here now. Uh, we got to put up our last two blocks in there so we can seal this all off but as you guys can see a lot of it is done now we just got to basically do the upgrading on our poles yet and probably in the middle here as well just so that looks looks good as well but for now let's get our flagstone blocks and let's put up our last couple poles here so we're gonna come over here and we're gonna Push R and whoops, yep. That's it. Copy rotation and there's one and two. So I do got a little bit of cobblestone to upgrade that. And bam, just like that. Now those gotta dry before we can upgrade them again. And we're gonna go ahead, upgrade all these, and watch that experience just roll up like crazy. It's so wonderful. All that XP is absolutely fantastic. Now, if we have enough time today, I'm really, really interested in getting that chem station going. So, I had a little bit of time to think about it, and like I said, if we have enough time, I'd like to go into town and start looting that big poppin' pills. Now, I know we're not gonna get it all looted in one shot, but I'd like to at least get a couple beakers out of it and get going on the chem station, like I said. So, you know, I guess we'll we'll see. I'm really, like I said I really want that. We need gas. We're pretty much pretty much out of gas. We got a little bit in our in one of our chests inside our base there, but for the most part, it's we have to find it. I was really hoping that the trader would have a chem station ready to go so then we could just put a couple points in for the gas can schematic or that the traders would have beakers, but traders had some really crappy loot this time around. I was, I was a bit disappointed. I'm, I don't know. But enough of that. We got lots of upgrading to do. And we got tons of cement from looting the the big farm over there at Bob's Boar and Carl's Corn there. Just an absolute wealth of building materials for there, which is great because we need a lot. This is a lot of upgrading to do, and I know it's probably more than we need for the Day 7 Horde, but I want that XP, that XP getting us them skill points going early on is yeah it's just so worth it I think but yeah there we go now we got to do the top one now this is only the first level of of the concrete so I think it goes to 2500 when it's dry and then We'll upgrade it again to the 5k and upgrade it again after it's at reinforced we will need forged steel now that's gonna that's gonna take some time we're gonna have to spec into mining a lot more as well as well the gas is a huge thing because most of the mining I want the auger for the auger is just once you've used it you really don't want to use anything else I mean it's just 
It's just so nice to use. It's quick. And we do have enough diamonds now to where we can make one of them diamond, uh, diamond blade tips for it to increase its durability. Now that's going to help out a lot along with that. Along with the tank mod in it. We're going to be able to just sit there and mine for freaking days. So yeah. Cannot wait for all that wonderful stuff. Get to actually start upgrading them couple blocks there as well. My guess is them being the weakest ones, the zombies might decide to smack them up a bit. But it's hard to say. The zombies are a little bit a little bit goofy, that's for sure. But we're almost to 60k XP already, and look at that, we just leveled up again. So absolutely fantastic. Over 60k XP now, and we're still we're still going strong. Now we don't have that much more of the mix on us, so we will be running out here, I think, pretty soon. I think we have a little over 3K, but that might be enough to get us all of this done that I want to. We got a we got a bunch more being made up as well, so our mixer is is pulling overtime. That's for sure. Seventy K XP already just from these upgrades and. That's not even all the upgrades we're going to be doing in here. So, yeah. Fantastic stuff, that is for sure. Get that one there as well. Alright, how much do we have left? We have a little over 500 left, so... We've got plenty of mix left. Oh, we got to upgrade these ones yet. I forgot. Yeah, we have a ton of skill points now. Um, whoops. Going to here. I Like I said, I was going to get the two points into here and get that done. So we might as well actually do that quick. Just spend them up. Um, yeah, I'm not sure. Not 100% sure what we should, we should work on next. I thought of getting some more mining stuff. But then again, I'm not too, too worried about that. Where is he going to drop her off? Ooh, right over there. That's not too bad, actually. Whoops. Hit the right button. That would help. Um, now, we could go into living off the land. We do have enough enough points to get another level on that. You know, we might as well do that. And that brings us one step closer to being able to make the seeds for the potatoes and the corn and the mushrooms that we're going to we're going to be using to be self-sufficient food wise now one more point left um god i don't know we'll drop one into salvage operations we use our our wrenches quite a bit so we already have lock picking i think that should set us up pretty good god i just wish i just wish we could get them beakers the beakers would be would be fantastic right now but these are all still wood the bars up here I'm going to be making forged iron and upgrading all of them and it's not that I even need to upgrade them you know it's more for like looks and XP is basically why I want that so anyway we're gonna drop off here a couple of these are dry already might as well hit them up and now we're going to start laying down our barbed wire. So we're just going to put one row entrenched like this. And the rest is going to go up here on the top. Probably go three deep with it for now. Not going to get too carried away with it. Just enough to kind of slow them down. Whoops. That didn't need to go there, but that's okay. Um, but yeah, I want to get them slowed down as they're coming in. Because then, you know, it allows us to have more time to shoot them before they get right to our doorstep and start banging on our freshly built horde base here. So, 
Um, let's, yeah, let's do something like that, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, this should work all right. It doesn't have to be perfect right now either. So, um, but yeah, I will finish laying this all down and I'll be back to you guys in just a little bit. Let's actually see where that airdrop is quick. Oh, it's only right down there. So yeah, we'll probably go and hit that up too here in a minute. But let me get the rest of the barbed wire placed down and I can show you guys what it's all going to look like. Alright guys, just finished placing the spikes and other than that one mistake one right there, they all went in pretty good. Um, for some reason this one wouldn't let me. I was going to, I just hit it with the axe because I thought maybe it, I had placed a phantom one. Because sometimes you'll place something and it won't register. But that wasn't the case, so I just figured I'd check it out. Um, should be able to reach these, yep. Do a little more upgrading as we can here quick. Want it done as much as possible. I mean, it doesn't have to be perfect for the first horde night, but like I said, I'm kind of a... Kind of really want that XP as much as possible. The more skill points we get, the earlier on, the quicker we'll progress through everything. Okay, that one must just be wet or whatever. There we go. A couple more to go here. and Then we're probably going to run and take a look at that airdrop quick. Um, I'm going to have to dip into the gas stash that's in the crate at the base, but yeah, I don't know. Um, beakers, as far as as far as I know, about the best spots we're going to have a chance to get them is at like the popping pills. So I don't know, I guess we'll we'll take a look there. Uh, I don't know if we'll get too much of that done today but you know we do got horde night coming up oh that's it for now all right so we're out of that for the moment but yeah i don't know how much of that we'd get done we do got horde night to contend with tonight so yeah um what do i got inside here i think i cleaned this out oh no i Only got a couple things there, but grab them out quick and got some more sand going. I I swore I had put some uh some more what you call it uh thought I had was making a bunch more of that, but apparently I wasn't. I must have already done that and collected it, so. Brain fart, something like that, I guess. Who knows? But let's take a look at what we actually got left for gas here. Got 1,800. That is the end of our gas. So I'm going to take out half of that for now. Let's head on out to that airdrop there. Whoops. I love to fall off that thing. I got to remember to put blocks up. Because I, the other day off camera, I was, I don't remember what I was doing, but I went to go down from there, and yeah, splat, busted my leg. Yeah, it kind of sucked, but I didn't have a splint either. No, I didn't bust it. I sprained it. That's what it was. So, but anyway, enough of that. I will meet you guys as soon as we arrive. All right, guys, just pulling up now. Here she be. Let's kill that guy off quick. Rawr to you two. Oh, I'm a terrible shot. Absolutely terrible. But put on the lucky goggles and pray for two beakers. And... 
Yeah. We'll just call that Jack. <laughs> the food is nice, don't get me wrong, but we're really not hurting for food, so yeah. Just like when we did those buried treasure quests, basically all we got was freaking food. It's like, come on. So yeah, we're gonna take a little a little stroll into here, do a little bit of quick looting before before our horde night kicks off. Now we don't have a ton of ammo for Horde Knight, but we should be okay, I think. No, I'm going to kill that guy off because, I don't know, I just feel like shooting him. You ever get that where, where you just decide, ah, I, I got to shoot that one zombie. What are you doing? Freaking zombie. All right, let's loot up these trash bags quick. I don't know, I just... I'm actually going to sell this. We don't even need to make one. We have two of them, I think. So, yeah, I'm, I'm dying. Dying to get myself that that chem station set up. Now, if all else fails, I believe one of our traders has, has a working one. So, that's like our last resort, though. I want my own because I don't want to have to run back and forth to the trader for that. But I guess you do what you got to do, so. Anyway, we're harvesting these up. More rotten flesh, more bones, nitrate, a little bit of polymer stuff, too. All great stuff here quick before we go inside. Um, do I have anything to eat on me? Oh, never mind. Duh. Yeah, of course you do. You just picked up a whole bunch of stuff. Yeah, pots. Eat up a bunch of this before we go in quick. Then I'm going to make myself a drop chest here. Let's go give this tree here a little smacky smack. And, yep, that's enough. You come to the wrong hospital, lady. Ooh. That might be good. And... Yeah, no. <laughs> like, ooh, that might be good. Uh, no. No, it wasn't. So, that's okay, though. I have high hopes for this building. I really do. Just something about it. I could just feel it coming. You ever get that feeling? I know I'm almost always wrong, but... Drop all this in here. Uh, I think we can actually read this one. Yes, we can. Kill some female zombies. All right. We can do that. Put them bad boys on. And let's head on inside here. Oh, we got company right away. Oh. Right in the throat. What the hell? A little lift right there. There we go. She's down for the count. Uh, might as well put these on. I think that's it for zombies up here. Now this is a huge place. This is going to be a couple episodes worth of cleaning out. That's for sure. Anything hiding back there? Nope. Come on, Beaker. Oh, I thought that was a beaker for a minute. I was like, yes! No. Darn. Alright, what do we all get there? I don't want the lead. That'll do, pig. Kill some boars. Of course, they give us that quest after we just cleared out Bob's boars. What's the, what's the irony in that? Alright, kill this guy too. Ooh, that was like right under the chin. Somebody's smashing some stuff. Oh, they must be in here. Yep, hello. Goodbye. Ooh. Nothing to lose your head about there, lady. Alright, let's throw these back on. 
Ah, oh, lead again. Hello? Anybody home? Nothing hiding. Always got to make sure there's nothing hiding. There tends to be a lot of stuff they like to sneak in there on you and make you really look for. All right. Garbage. Garbage. Wait. What about that t-shirt? Oh, we still had our plant fiber shirt on? Really? Wow. Man, I've been slacking. Ooh, somebody's angry. Ooh, that was almost a bad throw. Ow, that was uncalled for. Quit hit. That's not nice. Ooh. Ooh. Almost got some spike action. There. Come on, buddy. Oh. Whoops. That was kind of odd. Went to throw it and it just like fell out of my hands. Give me that back. Keep trying to steal my spear. All right, well. Make sure, oh, there's one. Shh. Oh, it's locked. Oh. Hey, hey, patience. Let them guys out. Make sure they're not feral. Come on. Ooh. That was juicy. Alright. Anybody else alive in here? I want to do some looting. No? Everybody dead? Good. Or rather, everybody dead again? But, ooh. Th those are nice right there. That's... That's well worth the trip in itself. Those mushroom seeds are fantastic. Ooh, level 26 now. All right. I'm going to put some more into perception because I want to boost my lucky looter again, and we need level 5. So. Chop these nasty, gooey things up. The hell just like broke and fell apart. Hmm. Oh, whatever. All right, there's some interesting stuff in cadaver drawers here. But I guess, I guess that's no different. The stuff in the cadaver door is kind of like the stuff you find in the coffins. It's a little bit interesting, I'll say. You know, every time I see them in glass jars, I'm like, ooh, we got it. And it's like, no, nope, no, we didn't. All right, what was that? Grilled meat? Yeah, don't really care. Um... We can get rid of that. Yeah, damn. Oop. I see you up there. Some sham in a purse. That thing was in my way. I had to take it out. All right. Nothing hiding. Oh, something's hiding. Come on. Nada. Nah. 
whack. More like splat, but... Alright, let's check see if there's anything hiding in the roof. I doubt there is, but... Nope, not a... Alright, let's go make a little bit of a drop-off quick. And then we'll continue on our merry way here. Um, this way. Lots of loot gonna come out of this place, that's for sure. Lots. It's gonna be... It's gonna be quite the place to loot, that's for sure. Now, we are finding some nice stuff, don't get me wrong, but... I'm here with one thing in mind, and so far... It's been a bust. Whoops. Make sure I didn't... Didn't accidentally scrap them. I think that's what I did with my... With my other lucky goggles that... That I lost. I think I scrapped the damn things. Oops, we don't go through there. Where the hell do we go? I'm lost. A little bit confused here. Forget where I'm supposed to go. It's not in the basement, is it? This isn't like a weird dungeon layout, is it? Okay, that makes sure we're just going to go pounding through the door and not the big door though. Good lord, the HP on that, on them, on these big doors here. Holy crap, you'd be at that for like days. Just look. 7k. Oops. Piss somebody off. Right, let's jump up here and we're going right out through here. Just like that. Ooh. I really didn't wake up the other one. Sure. <laughs> I'll take it. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. I'm horrible. There we go. Ah. Yeah, we might as well put our knife on for this. They're not happy in there, are they? Yeah, you guys just be patient. I'm coming to kill you. Just... Okay, apparently we're going through that. Whoa, hello. Boom. Ooh. You're coming to see me, huh? Okay, you guys already opened up a hole. Why not keep going through it? Oops. Get up here. There we go. Now we'll cut on in through here. Where the... Wait. We were just in there. We do have to go through here. All right. Hello? Nope. Nada is the word. Whoops. Swap them up. And... Acid's nice. The lead is really easy to find, so... Not too concerned with that. Um, up we go, I guess. Take a quick look around here, make sure we're not... Whoops. Ooh. Yeah. Whoa. Uh. Ooh, there's a safe. Close this. Yes, we can. All right, guys, let's let's crack right into this bad boy here. Hopefully it gives us something good just before Horde Night here. Now what I'll do is after we end the episode, I will go back and finish upgrading stuff. Getting it all ready to go, so. Then we'll be ready for Horde Night. Horde Night ought to be a good one. 
Bye bye. Bye bye. Keep the rest. Sounds like there's a bunch of pissed off zombies out here. I will let them break in. Let them do the heavy lifting. Oh, come on. Oh, shit. There's a lot of them. Stay down. there. Good lord. Is that everybody now? Damn. There's a bunch of them. Alright, yep, this is back out here now. Okay. Oop. Almost missed the suitcase. Nothing in it, so... Oh, now we got to go around to go back in. We're going this way. Where are they? Oh, those are outside. Now nah, you guys can stay out there. Oh, shit. All right, switch goggles. Just like so. Uh-oh, that's a problem. Stay down. There we go. Anybody else? Doesn't look like anybody else. Alright. Whoops. Let's go this way. And we'll head on down. Oh, now there's somebody else. Couple quick little tappity taps. Come on. One more. There it is. Ooh, medical pile. Come on, Beaker. I don't know if Beakers could even be in there, but I'm hoping everything's got a Beaker. Everything. Put on the right goggles. A little bit of piss water. Eh, nothing too too special anyway. All right. Ooh, shit. I see you. Whoops, no, don't scrap it. Shit, I scrapped him. Damn it. I did it again. Oh, now I'm pissed. Scrap my damn goggles. Again. Holy shit, how many of you are? Damn it, I can't believe I did that. I caught that at the last second, too. Damn it. Okay. Oh, yeah. Well, I guess we don't have to worry about switching goggles anymore again. I think what I'm going to do is if we get another good pair of lucky goggles, I'm just going to sell off the nerdy goggles. Because, yeah. I'm pissed with myself right now. That's the second time I've done that. Oh, shit. Hello.
Oh, what do you do, though? That's what I get for being in a hurry and trying to be greedy, isn't it? Man. Alright. Let's break this lady out. We'll finish looting up the little bit of stuff that's in here. And then we'll call this an episode. And then, like I said, I'm going to go back. I'm going to finish... Finish doing all my upgrading and stuff like that. And yeah, we'll go... F Our next video will be us going after the Horde Knight. Um, what can we get rid of here? Bye-bye, wrenches. I don't care about you right now. Oh, crap. Um, get rid of that. We'll scrap that. Get rid of that. Whoops. Grab the stuff. Alright, gotta be a little bit quick. We're... We're going long in this... Oh, shit. Hello. That kind of scared the shit out of me, to be honest. Alright. <gasps> we got a beaker. Oh, my God. But it's only one. We need one more. Come on. Come on, game. Where's my other beaker? Oh, now I'm, I'm like desperately searching. Give me the beaker. Come on. What the hell are them? Garbage. It's not a beaker. Don't, don't pay attention. Oh wait, no, we gotta have that. Gotta have that. Um, let's just use up that. All right. Nothing good. Oh, acid's good. Come on, beaker. I don't think we can get a beaker in here, but I'm still going to root for it. Come on, we need our second beaker to end the episode. Come on, you can do it. No! Shit, just use that up. We need a little bit of HP anyway. Where's my beaker, damn it? Um, what should we get rid of here? Let's drop the beaker. We don't need it. We don't need it. Get rid of it, right? No, I don't want the lead. I want them. Oh, I want that sandwich, though. Bye-bye, paper. Ooh. Is there a beaker hiding behind you? Hell no. What does this do? Ah, can't waste that. Do that. Ooh. Oh, I thought that was something else from it. Do we have room? Yes, we do. Okay. Get this up quick, and this will be it for us. The episode went a little bit long, but... The beaker hunt is serious business. I'll tell you that. So anyway, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Hope you guys are liking the hunt for the beaker, I, I think is what we should call this, because, yeah, that's that's exactly what we need. And hopefully we can get one more, if we're lucky, maybe from Horde Knight. Get a loot bag drop. But, yeah, I cannot believe I scrapped my freaking Lucky Goggles we, we just bought. We literally just bought the damn things, and I scrapped them. I feel like such a, yeah, such a putz. Well, worse than that, but... I'll be nice on camera. But yeah, I, I'm i so pissed with myself for that. Just can't even put it to words. I'm furious about that. But anyway, guys, we're going to call the episode here. If you're enjoying it, remember to smash that like button. Comment down below. Let me know what you guys think about my stupidity with the, with the goggles. What the hell is back here? No. Get the spikes, please. Before we end the episode, we gotta look. Oh, it's stairs. Anything back here? Alright. So, yeah, if you guys are enjoying the, the series so far, let me know in the comment section down below. Um, 
any tips on getting a beaker other than hitting the popping pills the luck with the supply drop that sort of stuff let me know as well because we really need one more and then we can get our chem station going um yeah we're gonna be doing horde night tonight so yeah that's what two and a half hours away i think so i gotta get home get all my stuff get some torches put up all sorts of fun business to do so hope you guys are ready for that i am as well and yeah we will catch you guys in the next episode thank you guys so much for being here